All right, this is Leonidas from the Leonidas Marketing Blog, and welcome to the AdWords Paper Call 5.0 video. The last time we had a video was back in 2015, so it's about time that I created an updated uh, version of that same video. So let's just skip all the nonsense and go right into creating our campaign. So we're gonna create uh, two type, different types of ads, all right? We're gonna create a call only ad where when they click on the ad, they go directly into a phone call. And the second type of ad, uh, which is the main difference of this video compared to the previous video, is that the second type of ad will be a text ad which, which includes a call extension on the ad. And we're gonna simply make sure that the ad itself only shows up on mobile-based devices, okay? and um, so i'll go into detail further on but let's go ahead and start creating our call only ad so here's your adwords interface and what we want to do is click on campaign we'll do search network only we'll do all features okay we'll name our campaign paper call uh, call only Okay, so for Google search networks, you always exclude the search partners because they're completely irrelevant. For your locations, okay, your location is wherever you want to advertise, whether it's Canada, US, Philippines, uh, Australia, Thailand. Okay, so that's relevant to your particular offer or agency. We will select uh, targets and the people in your target location. If, for example, we don't want people from Australia clicking on our ads if the advertisements are specific for Canada, okay? And the languages, whatever the language is relevant to you. For the bid strategy, I feel like to use manual CPC, so uh, manual bidding itself, and we'll do, for example, $1 in this case, and our budget will be $20 per day. So theoretically speaking, we should be able to get um, a minimum of 20 phone calls per day, okay? So let's go ahead and hit delivery methods and we'll hit accelerated, okay? Now you'll notice down here, there's an option for call extensions. So add extensions specifically and call extensions. And we are gonna keep this for the second type of ad we'll make later. But for the call only ads that we are about to make, they are completely un un uh, unnecessary. And for your ad schedule, so let's just assume that the business that I'm running is a nine to five. So we'll do a Monday to Friday from 9 a.m. till 5 p.m. Okay, so this is in your agency or based on your affiliate offer specifically. And for the ad group name, we'll just call it call only ad group. Okay, so this is for tutorial purposes. And we'll hit call only ad. Our business name is the United's Marketing Blog. Okay. And our phone number will be 888-324-3456. Okay, so this number is relevant to whatever you're promoting. And need pay per call um, advice. Question mark, free paper call guides, tap now. Okay, so I like the tap now option because that, that implies that they should be tapping on your ad. And the display URL will be leonidasmarketingblog.club and the verification, wrong URL. Go, the United Marketing Club, and the verification URL will be our HTTPS slash slash the United Marketing Club. Okay, and for call conversions, okay, so this is the very uh, specific part about our call only ads. We actually have to click manage conversions, and we are going to have to make a new conversion for uh, call only ads. But in this case, we need to make a website verification one. So therefore that Google, every time you every time you make a new call only ad, Google can verify that it is from a legit business or like a, um, from a legit website, so to speak. So we'll do conversions, we'll hit website, okay? And we'll do website 
of verification two. All right, so if you saw my previous video on how to create your own website, uh, then you'll pretty much see this same exact process. The value is completely irrelevant, so don't assign a value, and that's pretty much it. All right, so I'll create, create that one, so we'll do website verification two. There we go. And now you need to copy this code, so tag for website verification, and you will need to copy that to your website. So whether, um, and hold on, and that code has to go between your body tags. So whether you are uh, aware of how to put that into your website or not, you should, you can ask your website developer or your administrator or whoever else. But in this case, I already have a website ready. So if you followed my how to make a website guide, you'll know how to do this. So we'll go back to our leonidasmarketing.club. So this this uh, front page here might change over time, but that's the relevant part. Our website is based on WordPress. So we will go to our uh, administrative dashboard. So there's two options to verify your website. The first one is to simply create a post. And on there you can create, to, you can verify your number. Actually, we'll, we'll do a page. So we'll create a page and the page won't be really visible to anyone other than yourself. So uh, website verification. And on here you can post whatever phone number you want, but in this case, 888-324-4567. Okay. Now you can technically just take this URL here. So copy link address go back to the ad creation uh, process and under verification URL, you can actually just paste it in there, okay? But let's say, for example, you're dealing with you know dozens, if not hundreds of different phone numbers, let's say you're an affiliate marketer, then that's not the best option for you to do. Of course, you can keep adding the phone number to that page, but that's not the uh, most optimal option. So in that case, what we want to do is we take this code, we hit copy, we go back to our website, we go to plugins, and we hit plugins, uh, we hit add new, and we'll do head footer, and we want to install this head footer and post injections uh, plugin, okay? So once it is, in, so you just hit install now, for example here, and then you hit activate. So once it is activated, you go to your settings, and you go to header and footer and you go to the bottom here before the uh, slash body tag okay and you simply paste the code in here bam now your website is verified okay so we'll hit save okay and this web website verification is now available, so Google will start verifying your website. And the next thing actually, what you want to do is you want to create a call conversion. So this is specifically if you're an affiliate marketer, you'll go back to conversions tab and you'll create a new conversion. So we're gonna go to the phone call section here and we're gonna hit select and then calls from ads using call extensions or call only ads, okay? There you go. And then you just simply name it uh, however long and however much money you make from each phone call. So it's, we can say, let's say $50 for a um, 180 second phone call, okay? We'll hit done, we'll hit the value. Each call is worth $50. Okay, this is the US currency base and the call length. So while while I indicate it's 180 seconds, I really recommend you just put 185 or even 190. So this really indicates that the person has been on the line for quite some time. Count one conversion only. Okay, so this is once again if you are running through affiliate based offers. And close. And that's done. Okay. So we can't add the conversion just yet. It won't appear just yet, but we'll change that in just a second. And then we'll simply add 
paper call marketing tips and advice. Okay. Um, I'm going to show you how I usually do it. So, pay plus per call guide. There you go. Okay, so this, these pluses indicate a broad match modifier. So these words can be in any specific order, but um, all four of them have to be in the, someone has to be looking for all four of these words at the same time. If you want something more generic, then you do broad match, which is like this. So someone be, can be typing in uh, pay-per-view guide, uh, pay-per-view offers, whatever, stuff like this, but it might not be related completely to what you want to advertise. So I really recommend you include the specific words you want and go broad match only when you need more clicks to your website or you want to expand and just to see what people are clicking on um, that could potentially aid in your conversion process. So we'll hit save ad group. Okay, and we'll go back to our ads. All right, so go, go ahead and edit the ad and you'll go down to conversion actions and then it should say uh, our new conversion metric. So $50 for 180 seconds and save ad. Okay, great. Now this under review process will simply go to your website to see that the, the, verif that the code is there, okay? or if uh, the phone number is on the page that you use to verify the website and then it should be good to go okay so anytime someone clicks on the ad uh, anytime someone types in your keywords they will simply see a phone number okay they'll see the phone number and when they click on the ad they simply go just to uh, a phone call okay so clicking on here we'll just go straight into a phone call all right now the next type of ad is call, is going to be a mobile only ad and it's going to use the old style of um, generating phone calls which is someone going directly to your website but your mobile website and on there you will have a call uh, button. Okay, Now I won't go into detail on how to create the call button on your website but you can definitely check out that, that out on my premium23.com blog but in this case we'll simply make the ad. So. Here we go, let's do a text ad. And the final URL is gonna be your landing page, whichever you want people to go to. So leonidasmarketing.club. Okay, so free paper call guides. Get help or learn paper call marketing from Leonidas on how to run paper call. marketing or your agency or affiliate office okay so let's go ahead and hit save actually we'll do we'll add an extra path in there so we'll do um, paper call guides all right so what we want to do is, is um, when someone clicks on this specific ad Show you how it ends up looking. Once again, when they click on this ad, they'll end up going to a website. Okay, but what we also want is that, for example, they uh, they are able to go into a phone call as well. So, we'll hit add extensions. Okay, right at the top here, and then we'll make a new extension, or rather, make sure you click on a view whatever extensions and you go down to call extensions and then what you'll see is you'll see this option here okay and then hit new number and then make sure to type in whatever number is associated with your business so three two four four five six seven 
all right? And device preference doesn't matter because we're gonna be making sure that our ad shows up on mobile only anyway. And we're gonna hit advanced and conversion actions. So since our conversion metric is already created, we simply open it up and $50 for 180 seconds and hit save. And that's pretty much it for associating a uh, phone number to your ad. Now the last thing we want to do is we want to make sure that our ad only shows up on mobile devices. So we'll go to our campaign at the top here. You can click on the campaign itself or on the side here even, right here, just click on that. And then under devices, change devices bid adjustments. Okay. And what we want to do is we want to make sure that computers and tablets are not showing up. Uh, our ad does not show up on these devices. So we'll make sure to decrease by 100%. And click here as well, decrease by 100%. Fantastic. And now we are pretty much complete. We'll go to our ads and here after about 30 minutes to an hour, the ads should be up root. Okay. And you're pretty much good to go. Now, some things you should note, make sure that you, uh, if you're just learning, make sure you always bid really low. Okay. So always start bidding low and then gradually as you start generating good cash and good money, you increase your bids. You can increase your budgets from $20 to $100, et cetera, et cetera. And look at what keywords are showing up. So always start off with broad match modifier. Always start adding the plus in front of every single uh, keyword. And then eventually as you get more experience, you can start taking those away. And under dimensions, actually we can just stick to keywords here. And then under keywords, you can look at search terms. And here you will see what people are actually uh, searching for and when they end up clicking on your ads. So anyways, once again, this is Leonidas from the Leonidas Marketing Blog. I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope I was able to cover everything for you as quickly as possible. And make sure to sign up to the Paper Call Training Guides. I'm going to continue updating them um, as effectively and as professionally as possible just for you. And I'll continue expanding to make sure to show you all of the methods to generate um, leads and whatever else to AdWords and Facebook and Bing ads. Okay, so Leonidas here and I will see you in the next video. Salute!